Hey everybody, Anne here, and I decided it was high time to get those decals off the sides of the van. Turns out you don't need magical powers to get it done. All you need is a hot air gun and a plastic scraper thingy and some time. Here we go. Well, today's the day that I am going to start getting this stuff off with my heat gun. Yeah, I've already got a couple numbers off. I got one of the hands off. Um, and I've just got, I think I got this from... Home Depot, maybe Lowe's, not sure. It's only 1200 watts, so it's not even the most powerful one. And it works. And you don't even have to keep it on for very long. And it's kind of cold outside, it's about 35 degrees out right now. So, yeah. Let's see. Let's kind of get one of the edges going. And then just peel it off. Careful because it's hot. A little bit hot. Okay, let's see. Let me try one more for you. Nope. Let me get my other little thingy. I'm driving this all the time now. And I'm getting used to it. Getting used to the sounds it makes and whatnot. Kind of paying attention to what's... See how easy that comes off? Yeah. I'm so glad. I was dreading doing this, and this is easy, and this is even doing it when it's super, super cold outside. I figure I get the telephone number off first. So yeah, I'm going to see if I can at least get this whole wall done. Um, I'll come back when I've got more done. <laughs> Talk to you later. Bye. So yeah, it's not too hard at all, and the sound of that heat gun was just so loud, it drowned out my voice for the rest of these little snippets that I did, so I'll just go ahead and narrate over the top of them. And it's not too hard. Just be careful that little metal nozzle at the end, it stays hot. Uh, the rest of the gun, the plastic doesn't get hot at all, but that little metal nozzle gets very, very hot. So be super careful that you don't touch that part. <laughs> I know most people wouldn't have to be told that, but I burnt myself on it in the same place three times. Um, but it's okay. I mean, I meant well. But see how it just pulls off and that little plastic thing? Yeah, I didn't get a metal scraper, just a plastic one, so I didn't scratch the van, even though it's got plenty of scratches on it anyhow. The big letters were the easiest to get off. Those hands, oh my gosh, because there's so many different little pieces to them. They were so hard, they took forever. But these big letters, you just put the heat gun over them for about five seconds over the, you know, over the whole area. You don't even need to do it for that long, really. Um, five to 10 seconds tops. Just get your little scraper and get part of it going at the top there. And then just grab it and peel it off. Oh, my poor hands, my poor hands. I've been damaged. Somebody get that girl a manicure for her big man hands. <sighs> and they are so dry and so cold outside. I don't know, I need some moisturizer. And I've been digging in my worm bin too, oh my goodness. But it was, it was awesome. It was a fun project and... I froze to death, basically, outside. It was, it was pretty cold outside. But it, the time went by really fast. I mean, I think start to finish it took about four hours total. I was just so, so happy that I was able to do it. Like I said in the beginning, it doesn't take magical powers. You know, I, I doubt myself. I think, I'm not going to be able to do that, you know? You got to have special stuff to do it. Well, the only special thing that you need is a heat gun, and you might even be able to do it with a really good hair dryer. But yeah, so look here. <laughs> look, it's all off. Now all I need to do is get some goo gone. Or um, somebody said WD-40 works to get the rest of the little residue off and then give it a good washing. Look at that van, doesn't it look great? It's gonna look so awesome. And I put felt on the back windows, not the very back, not these, but on the back side windows so that uh, nobody could see in. Oh, and I'm gonna leave, I'm gonna leave those little hands there just because I've got some grandkids. Now all these on this side, the hands, they're all gonna come off, but I was so frozen by the time everything was done that I just needed to get it done. Uh, I went inside. I just couldn't do any more that day. But I'm going to keep a few hands on there in honor of my grandkids. So look at that. Ain't she pretty? I'm so happy.
Thanks for watching everybody. Don't forget to subscribe and please give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you didn't like the video. Oh, and hit the bell and y'all have a good one.